So by now, I'm just going to assume you've seen Spider-Man Homecoming. If you haven't, I'm sorry, spoilers are coming, but one of the big things that never happens in the movie is of course we don't get flashbacks to Uncle Ben. We don't even get to hear the famous line of with great power comes great responsibility. And honestly, I'm okay with that, but I hope they deal with that down the road at some point, or at least mention what happened in this universe, and at least make Peter Parker remember those lines. But hey, we could have actually had it in Spider-Man Homecoming, and it could have been much, much much worse. Yahoo Movies actually got to catch up with people responsible with some of the aspects of the movie and asked them why that wasn't in and was there ever a version where it would have been actually included in there. And they say yes they actually did include it. So essentially at the end of the movie there would have been a scene where Happy Hogan, you know played by John Favreau, uh, is in the room with Peter Parker and he says oh yeah uh, Tony wanted me to tell you with great power comes great something I forgot but they decided not to use that because they felt like it just kind of was a little too meta they say and a little bit too much because that's the one thing Uncle Ben passes on to him you know right before he dies and it kind of shapes the person Spider-Man and Peter Parker are. So yeah um you know there's obviously a lot in these comic book movies that I defend whether it's Marvel or DC or X-Men or whatever the hell it is um sometimes you have to make smart choices that are different just because you have to but as long as you stay true to the core of the character I'm honestly okay with these changes as long as you don't change the core of the aspect of the character. A core aspect of Spider-Man is Uncle Ben telling him that. If you give that to Tony Stark, you're literally taking away everything. And who would Tony Stark be to mutter those words to someone? Like, really? Like, it, that's the most un-Tony thing to do. Like, it, just the way he was in the movie anyway, that just never would have worked. So, honestly, I'm glad they decided not to do that. Because, quite frankly, that would have been terrible. And if that would have been in the movie... I probably would have just freaked the hell out. Like that's that's completely not right. So um good job on making sure you guys didn't include that cuz that would have been just way too disrespectful. 